and welcome back to Pick Me Up Scotty and I'm Scotty and if I look exactly the same that's because I just shot the other video same outfit same time and I figured with smaller sets like this why not just film it and just give it to you guys too because they're really small and there's not too much to say but what we're looking at here is from Wang Ge and this is Wang Ge CN Tower of Toronto number 4215 400 pieces now this is not my first architecture, this is like my third one, second one, third one, fourth one, I can't remember. And I blame one person for all of that, and his name is Trucker Nick. Trucker Nick got me the San Francisco Golden Gate Bridge. I haven't brought it down to the office yet, I'm still trying to figure out how to carry it down. But because of him, I'm now addicted to architecture. Anyway, they sent this to me, and they said, can you review it? And yes, I can, so this is why we're here. Now this thing is so tall, I had to make the camera a little bit wider so you can see the top here. And the camera over there, they can't even see the whole thing unless I pan it like this. Dun, 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 dun. Look at how tall that is, whoa, that is tall. So this is 400 pieces, meaning it's not gonna be very long for you to build. And it's very, very cool, I really like it. I think there's no problems with it at all. Look at that, it looks like it's gonna fall over on that camera. Yeah, doo doo doo, doo doo doo. I like the bottom here. I really like the water tile and the printed sign here. It says the CN Tower of Toronto. So hello to all my Canadian friends over there. Here you go, nice tower, right? Pretty cool, I like it. Now it is a little bit flimsy, meaning like you just have to be careful. The cup part actually does come off, which is really cool. You can separate it and you can take this bottom piece off. You can travel with it and put it wherever you need to put it and then put it back together like so. Looks like a rocket on the top. So my review, my final thoughts of this is it's actually pretty cool. I really like it. It stands out tall. I like the size of it. It's really neat. And it looks cool. It looks futuristic, yeah? Oh, and the manual I should show you, by the way, is actually really good. Look, very easy. This one is actually pretty easy to read. You guys can get used to it really fast. Thank you, OneGay, for making this small. So because there's not much else to say about it other than it's actually pretty cool, I have no problems with it. I think it's pretty dope. I'm just going to read the description for you guys and show you some nice beauty shots right now. The CN Tower. It's a 553.33 meters high or 1,815.4 feet concrete communications and observation tower in downtown Toronto, Ontario, Canada. I did not know that. It was completed in 1976, becoming the world's tallest freestanding structure and world's tallest tower at the time. It held both records for 34 years until the completion of Burj Khalifa and Canton Tower in 2010. I don't know if I said that right. It is now the third tallest tower in the world and remains the tallest freestanding structure in the Western Hemisphere. The more you know. A signature icon of Toronto's skyline and a symbol of Canada. Its name CN originally referred to Canadian National. Since the name CN Tower became common in daily usage, the abbreviation was eventually expanded to Canadian National Tower or Canada's National Tower. However, neither of these names is commonly used. In 1995, the CN Tower was declared one of the modern seven wonders of the world by the American Society of Civil Engineers. It also belongs to the World Federation of Great Towers, where it holds second place ranking. So there you go. The CN Tower from one game They've been collecting the Lego ones, but you can't find other brand ones. Here it is. We sell it. It's on BrickMeUpScotty.com. So don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And I'll catch you guys later. All right. Brick me up. I don't think I've actually seen the tower. I have to think about that. Did I go? I went to Toronto before. I can't remember where I've seen it. She should start using this to point out like pieces on the bricks. You know, like this piece and that piece. No, but seriously, stay tuned for more architecture. If you really enjoy the channel, please do subscribe. I'll really appreciate it. I'll get you more videos. Yeah, you want more stuff? I'll get you more stuff, more architecture stuff. Okay, I'm gonna put this back on. It looks like it's gonna fall apart on me right now. So don't forget, subscribe here on Deer, on his head. Check out some videos you might've seen over here. Check out a couple more over here. You know how it works. Try to make another playlist just for architecture? I'm not sure. Or do I put it under the brand name?